Through our last couple of videos, you were given a tour of Superspace. Then we walked through how to submit a project to Superside. So let's just pretend you've received an email notification or a message through Asana or Slack saying that you have a draft ready for review. You click the link and head back into Superspace and select the project. If you have a lot on the go like me, I suggest filtering by action required or status. As you know already, this is the chat and this is where you'll find any news or updates on the project. You'll also find all the design assets associated with this project under this tab. That includes any resources included with the brief or uploaded since the kickoff. Anything awaiting review will be marked clearly so you know exactly what to look for, like this. Now, here is my favorite part, the review tools. When it comes to remote creative work, it can be really hard to communicate feedback in a way that's clear. Like, can you make that swirly thing in the background a tad more swirly? That sort of feedback won't make sense to most people, and it's a surefire way to waste time and delay the project, which is why Superside built the draw a comment tool. Check it out. When using this tool, you can change the size or color of the brush to differentiate different points of feedback. Or if drawing isn't your thing, use the point and click tool. You can even zoom in real close to comment down to the pixel. Plus, you can add attachments and links to further clarify your feedback with examples. This honestly saves so much time by reducing the amount of back and forth and prevents feedback from getting lost in translation, which is important because you have deadlines to hit. This is another cool feature. You can click this drop down over here to cycle through previous versions to see how the work has evolved. And if you want to download the file or share it with someone on your team to get their feedback, you can do that over here. Of course, for anything that's top secret, Superspace does give you the option to protect it with a password. When you're done leaving feedback, you can notify Superside of your request by clicking Ask for Changes. But if everything looks good, you can click Mark as Approved. Now, in the last video, we requested a video project. To review that or anything that isn't static, things look a little different. After you hit play, you can pause the video at any point and use those same drawing and commenting tools to leave feedback. Then your comments will show up down here as a timestamp and over here. Your Superside team can use these tools as well to ask questions or draw attention to key details. This is how Superspace makes creative collaboration as easy as, I don't know, editing a Word doc. And when you've approved everything, your creative project manager will follow up with a message like this, summarizing the hours used and the original estimate, along with a prompt to confirm that you've received everything that you need. And that's it, you're done. You can download your files or keep them here on Superspace before launching them to help achieve all of your marketing goals. Now, I'm doing all of this here in my office, but I can access Superspace anytime from any device. So when I wake up in the middle of the night and remember those ads that I forgot to brief, I can just log in, fill out the brief, and rest easy knowing Superside will get started in just a few hours. Because that's the flexibility and support you need to keep up with the speed and demand of today's market. And that's what you get with Superside. So talk to a Superside rep today to find out how you can get started.